bench cookies. What are they? And what are they used for? The primary purpose is to be able to be on your workbench and put a work piece up on to four or six bench cookies spread out under supporting your work piece. And when you do that, that work piece is not going anywhere when you're when you're putting downward pressure on. You can then use that to sand, you can use a router, uh, you can do a number of things without having to sec secure that with clamps. I tend to go overboard and use clamps when I can anyway. Also with a work piece up, if you have any kind of a jig that you're trying to attach, you don't have to be around the edge of your work table. You can attach to your work piece because it's raised up and you got room for the for the clamps to go underneath. My first set were from uh, from Bench Dog and they're called Bench Cookies and they're just uh, look just like hockey puck. Then I recently got the uh, Bench Cookie Plus Work Ripper Master Kit and that came with eight bench cookies. It comes with a lot of different attachments. You could use them quarter inch dog holes. You can either have the long part down so it goes quite a way down or you can have the short part down so that it's higher up. So it's very handy for circular saw applications and jigsaw applications. You can also attach two of them together if you don't have bench dog holes in your workbench then you can accomplish the same thing by using these little uh, connectors. And then here's what Rockler has put together to go on top of your bench cookie in order to do the painting application. So you have a nice little point that's not going to damage your fine woodwork while you're doing the finish uh, but allow you to do both sides. But you can also just take a three quarter inch plywood, half inch plywood, <coughs> put a screw through it and uh, use that in order to do your painting applications. Now, I don't know about you, but if I'm doing a project, I probably have many more than one piece to get painted. So just having a set of these of your own. Now, don't lend them to your wife at Halloween because those nice, good looking birch uh, three quarter inch plywood pieces will come back uh, forever painted orange in the colors of Halloween. So I hope you found this uh, useful. Uh, give me a, uh, you know, a, a subscribe, give me a like, give me your comments. Uh, encourage this old fool to do more of our three-minute overviews. Small Workshop Guy, signing off.